always tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. Yeah, as I showed you going into the break, we're doing pretty good in terms of sunshine. Usually uh, November can be certainly a gloomy month. That's not been the case so far, at least most days. We're coming off our sunniest day so far over the month. They had 100% sunshine yesterday. I thought that would be a, a pretty good bet, and that was the case. Today, it's not going to be 100% sunshine. We'll have some high-level clouds out there, but we certainly will enjoy another beautiful day. Uh, right now, live views out there, calm, clear and colder. We'll get to those temperatures in just a moment, but I wanted to show you a broad view across the United States to show you how tame the weather pattern is at the present time. You can almost go coast to coast, especially in the center part of the country, uh, without running into any precipitation. Temperatures right now, 29 degrees in Grand Rapids. We're at 30 in Kalamazoo, 34 in Muskegon, and uh, certainly colder right now compared to yesterday. Uh, anywhere from 10 to as much as 20 degrees. The coldest difference uh, yesterday compared to right now is uh, along the lakeshore. We'll peak with a high temperature in the mid-50s today. And notice tonight's low temperatures won't be as cold as this morning. So I think we'll avoid the frost tomorrow morning. We have a clear sky out there and a calm wind. And that's resulted in uh, really a good setup for those cold temperatures. High pressure will continue advancing off to the east. That's going to allow for a lighter south wind today as we see a weak cold front approach from the north and west. It'll bring just a few clouds up to the north. It's going to go through dry as it looks uh, for tomorrow. And overall, tomorrow's going to be another day with a whole lot of sunshine. Now, I think we'll see an increasing cloud scenario on Thursday with an approach of a cold front that's going to bring in some much colder air, it looks like, uh, for this upcoming weekend. You can see we'll peak with the warmest temperatures on Thursday with that ridge building in with a high right around 60. But notice the blues start uh, infiltrating the Great Lakes this upcoming weekend. That is going to result in colder temperatures uh, in the 40s. So enjoy this nice milder stretch of weather in the, over the next few days. Actually, it looks like a falling temperature scenario on Friday. And the next, next chance of rain is going to be Friday morning. Tom, how the roads look out there? So far, things are looking pretty good out there across area roadways as we kick off this Tuesday morning commute. Uh, we've gotten to that point where we're uh, kind of diminishing on those uh, traffic or on the construction projects out there. Uh, so that is good news. Taking a look at the freeways right now, heading into and around the downtown GR area. If you are getting ready to head out the door, uh, no major problems developing across area freeways. US 131, I-96, 196, M6, all remaining crash-free for us. And then here's a live look for you. US 131, northbound and southbound, the S-curve heading into and out of downtown Grand Rapids. You can see we are working with light traffic out there. I'll have another update for you coming up in about 15 minutes. Teresa Donovan.